Hey guys, thank you so much for clicking on to another DOY Creation 7 video. Okay guys, I got some pretty cool items that I would like to share with you guys today. I hope you're able to see me really good and hear me really good because I don't have my mic on right now. So I hope I speak loud enough so you guys can hear and see me really good. All right, guys, so let me jump right into what I want to share with you guys. But before we get started, you know, I always like to give glory, honor, and praise to the Most High Yah. So, guys, I am in my craft room slash boutique. And so I wanted to stop in to share with you guys some items that is really hot off my crochet hook. Now, I was sharing with you guys that I was making myself a granny square shrug. So, I wanted to, I had this dressed out because I took some photos of my shrug on yesterday and I posted it on Instagram. Then I posted on Facebook and I did have a few people come back and say um, they really couldn't see the black shrug because I had it paired up with this dress right here. So let me show you a better view of that black granny square shrug. So this time I put it on with a, you know, a yellow tank top. So here's the shrug. Okay. And again, it's just a granny square fold in half, but I needed something to... You know, when I wear my dresses like this right here, that doesn't have sleeves, more like a halter top type of situation, I wanted to put a shrug on over it, okay? Or even when I'm wearing my tank tops or anything like that, and it's a cool breeze or something like that, I wanted to have, you know, a black shrug to go over it, okay? So I made this one for myself, and what I did was I just went a row uh, around the whole uh, shrug, and I just did a ruffle stitch, you know, the ruffles. So yeah, so that is how this worked up and turned out. I hope this is a better view of it. I think when I wear it actually with this dress, I'll take some pictures of, uh, of it. Um, on the outside but it would not be today so anyway there it is and um yeah that's the shrug i hope you guys can see that you know black is so challenging to see when you're trying to show it so i think when i start doing my videos on the outside that you guys can see things like in a darker color a whole lot better Another thing that I made, guys, that I enjoy making so, so much, I made another head wrap. Y'all, I cannot make enough of these head wraps. I love making this head wrap. This head wrap right here is in the Red Heart Super Savior yarn, and this one is the Great Fizz. So I made this one here. Now, if you're new to this channel... I do have a tutorial on how to crochet you a head wrap. And also, guys, if you're not a crocheter and you like and you want to support me, DOY Creation, I do have these available on my Etsy website. I will leave my website address in my description bar below. So anyway... This is the crochet head wrap that I really, really love. And again, I have the tutorial, guys, on how to make this one here. And I also have a, a video on different ways to wear these head wraps. If you want to see the different ways that I wear my head wraps, check that video out. I'll try to leave the, the link to that video down below. And you know I had to make some earrings. So I did make the little spiral earrings to go along with it. It'll go with this hat as well. But I did make this to go along with it. Okay. So, so cute. And I have made so many. 
Okay, I'm losing my voice. I have made so many of these spiral earrings, guys. But I think this is my favorite pair because usually when I make my spiral earrings, I make them like really, really tight. This one is more loose or hanging, more dangly. And I, figure out, I figured out how to actually make them look like this right here. But anyway, um, love, love, love this set right here. Yep. So this set is available on my Etsy website. Um, you won't see this color right here, but if you order one of the head wraps, all you have to do when you place in your order is leave a comment and say what color you would like. So don't get deterred because you only see blue. Um, I think part of the description is all colors are available. But if you want this one particular, just ask for the great fizz and then I would know which one to ship out. And these earrings will be included with your order. Okay, if you are interested in that. Another thing that I made, guys, that I'm super, super duper excited about is I made another Chrissy Poo poncho. These are called Chrissy Poo ponchos that I have, you know, created. So here's this one. This one is in the gray. That is the mainstay gray. And then this one is also in the Great Fizz by Red Heart Yarn. And I absolutely love these Chrissy Poo ponchos. This is how it flows in the back. Okay. And this is how it flows in the front. And what I love about these right here is you can wear it anytime, anywhere. So if you if you want to use it as a beach cover-up, a dress cover-up, or if you put on some leggings or a bodysuit and you just want to have something, you don't want to be that exposed. Um, these are so, so awesome to wear, guys. What do you guys think of these? I love my Chrissy Poo. I love making these. So I do have, um, let me sit that right there so she can get some show time. Can y'all see her? Can y'all see her? She is, she is so fabulous. Okay. I do have uh, my Chrissy Poo's available online as well. In case you want to check out some other colors, I need to add this one here um, to the website is not available yet. You can leave it in the comments if you are interested in purchasing that one as well. Um, if you want it before I actually load it on Etsy website, I can send you over a secured, um, what it is, a PayPal invoice. And once the invoice is paid, I'll ship your merchandise right on out to you. So I'll leave all my information email address, website, what have you not, in my description bar below. So I wanted to stop in to share. Let me give her some time too because they absolutely look fabulous together. Don't they look good? Can y'all see that? They look so good together. So anyway, guys, I wanted to... Um... Okay, she just falling back. I wanted to stop in to share with you guys those completed items. I'm still working on the sandals. So I have been kind of like uh, trying to get inspired by, you know, some tutorials, some DIYs that I have been looking at for crochet and flip flops. And I have ran, I have ran across quite a bit of people who have some pretty awesome um, tutorials. But I'm really thinking about freestyling mines because I do like a lot of my stuff to be unique or have my twist on it. I just want to get inspired by someone's video and then I'll, I'll put my own signature or my own twist to that what I see. So that is what I'm working on right now. I got my... Um, I haven't lined yet my bags yet. So once I line them, 
I'm going to be posting both of those fat bottom bags. Again, they are in gray and they are in black. And I love what um, God Rock said. She said, those bags are great for carry-on. So you know how you want to get on the airplane and you got that big bag and you want to use that as a carry-on. That would be so, so awesome because these bags are big enough to put quite a bit of items into it. So I just got to go ahead and line them up. And you guys will see that very, very shortly onto the uh, website. So make sure you just go over there to the website. You might find something that you like and you can purchase it. Again, I am offering free shipment. All U.S. customers only. The shipment is free. So make sure you take advantage of that as well. Okay, guys, I think that is it that I wanted to stop in to share with you guys today. Again, I think I have I have this uh, dress that I made. It's called a Bumblebee dress. And um, someone bought that dress for me, but they want me to add a skirt to the dress. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come back for all my newbies or if you miss that particular video on my bumblebee dress, I am going to show you guys a before picture and then I'm going to show you an after picture because it's a long dress that comes like from right here all the way down to her, almost to her ankle and she wanted to flare out as like a, put a nice skirt remnant on the bottom. So I'll show you guys the before picture and then I'll show you guys what I did with that alteration for that dress, which I think is going to be so, so awesome. So I'll come back and share that with you guys. All right, guys, I hope you guys are having a great morning, a great evening, a great night, whatever you may be. I hope the weather is tolerable. The weather is a very fair here in the Chi-Town or Chicago. So we are just really enjoying the nice weather. And I know wherever you are at, and if you just see the sunlight, you guys, I've been watching your videos. I think a lot of people are just getting excited just to see the sun out. That makes the weather a little bit more warmer. So that's really, really cool too. I, okay, guys, let me see. I just wanted to make sure I covered everything that I needed to cover with you guys. Let me know what you guys think about the new, the new items that I completed and all that good stuff. Please make sure if you have not subscribed, we don't know what you're waiting on. We just don't know what you are waiting on. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and also click the thumbs up. Leave a comment, share, and all that good stuff. All right, guys, until next video, always remember y'all some 68.4 in your King James Version. Always keep your life and your health in check. And I'll be checking you guys in the next video. Really, really, really soon. All right. Bye for now.